Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Eileen with the Unique Gifts and Decor by Lady Di. Happy Sunday, you all, to everyone. I am hoping everyone is having a wonderful day, or should I say had kind of, because it is 5.30 Eastern Standard Time here in North Carolina. But overall, it has been a wonderful day. I um, went to church this morning, um, heard some word um, at church as well. You know, I come home, um, our church service is at 8.30, so I come home, get home in time to hear uh, Bishop Dale Bronner. His, one of his services started at 11.30. So, you know, I got a lot of word in this morning. Um, you know, I am just feeling wonderful. Um, I in, had a birthday celebration with my family yesterday um, my kids, <laughs> they are awesome, okay, and my grands, they are all awesome, you guys, I really had a great celebration, um, I got flowers, um, I got those sherry berries, those great big strawberries, um, I got gift cards, I've got cash, and my kids took me to this, um, restaurant here in Greensboro, it's called Fleming's, it's a kind of fine dining, um, upper class steak house. Okay. But they have seafood and chicken and all this stuff, but their specialty is in these prime rib, um, steaks. And I mean, it was just beautiful. Um, I can't, um, your prom was going on. So, you know, you can see the kids dressed up in their prom outfits and everything, but, um, the restaurant was totally nice. Um, very unexpected for me. Um, what can I say? <laughs> it, um, I am usually a budget person. Okay. Um, but, um, you know, celebrations. Yeah. You know, you, you kind of want to go that extra mile, but, um, this restaurant, you guys is over the top. Um, I think the lowest price steak <laughs> was $46 for one steak that does not include the size the baked potato and whatever size you want to get just the steak $46 I looked at my son I'm like really <laughs> he said ma I said okay okay you know I'm going I'm gonna pipe it down whoo y'all but let me tell you the steak is was awesome I end up getting one that was um the it was the um, ribeye that had the bone in it. You guys, that steak was about this big, okay? I had to get a to-go box because it was so huge. Um, the baked potatoes was just as big as the steak. Um, the loaded ones, I mean, they come in this big dish. I mean, they had all kinds of sides, asparagus, green beans, mac and cheese. I mean, it was just, it was just elaborate, but it was cooked so fancy, okay? And, um... That steak was $68, you guys. And I'm just like, I can, I can go how many to Walmart and get how many steaks for $68, okay? <laughs> but anyway, it was beautiful occasion, you guys. We laughed. We reminisced. We just had a good time. My grandson, of course, he was just one year old. And when you go in, everything is so dark, you know. It's just that ambiance, you know. And he was looking all around. It's like, you know, is it time for me to go to sleep? Because it's dark up in here. But after he kind of felt his way through and everything, and, you know, we all had a good time. And, and um, you know, I, it was just good being around family. Um, I cannot say enough about my children. They are all successful. They are the families. Uh, my grandchildren, they're doing well in school. I mean, honor roll students. I mean, I can't go wrong in any kind of way. Very mannerable. Um, yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. I mean, it's just, you know, I guess because that was instilled in me, my daughter and her husband instilled those in, um, their children, which are my grands. So, you know, it was, it was just a good occasion. My son and his, um, fiance, they were there as well. So, you know, it was, it was just so cool. Um, I, I, I don't know what to say, but to just be pampered in to that magnitude, now, if they did this for my birthday, I don't know what they're going to do next month for Mother's Day. But you know what? I tried to be a detective and kind of see what they were kind of doing. So I knew I was going to a restaurant. Um, my do I called my daughter yesterday, and she uh, and she always, um, she's pretty good about keeping secrets. But she was like, well, we're coming down to have dinner with you. I said, okay, you know, and I'm saying, well, we're, you know, I didn't know exactly where we are going. So she was telling me Fleming. And she said, 
I said, Fleming, she said, yeah, she's a mama. That's very expensive. I said, I, you know, I'm like, really? So I went up on the uh, internet and um, checked out the, you know, see what it was all about. And it had the pictures and everything. It had some prices, but they didn't have all the prices that they probably should have put on the internet before anybody walk up in there. But, but anyway, <laughs> it was a great a restaurant. I, um... I recommend it um, to anyone if y'all have the Flemings in your walls area. I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure it is a nationwide restaurant. Uh, just make sure you can, you have a lot of money when you go because you buy, you're going to go about $100, $125 uh, just for yourself, okay? I'm just telling you, okay? But anyway, I'm coming on today to show you guys some concepts that we got these little trays. Remember when it was Valentine's Day, we got these little trays that they had out at the Dollar General. And I think after it went through the percentages, I think they went down to a penny. So they come in, I think it's four different sizes. So this one, small one, was originally $4, which just had the skeleton head on there. I kind of walked away from these uh, when they was going through the percentages. I'm like, oh, I don't deal with no skeleton, you know. But what I did find out is there is a screw inside there, and you can take that out which I have done and I'm going to show you. You can take a Phillips head screwdriver and you can just unscrew the item, that little skull thing. And it comes off, okay? Now it will leave a hole in there. Now you have two choices. I guess I have two choices. I can attach this and put this inside of the um, tray and let the buyer know it's there. But sometimes people don't like all this skull stuff. Some people go for it. I don't want to go for it. So I think what I'm going to do is just leave the hole there and just be done with it, okay? So in these concepts, um, we're going to build one today, but they have, uh, I think it's four, four different sizes, okay? So here's the first concept that I put together for this little small tray. So what I did here, um, what I did, I have some of those rose petals that I got from Timu. Um, I do have this bath set, and it's the Aromatherapy Signature Ginger uh, Citric Scented. Now, they have these at the Dollar Tree with the bath salts. I do have a kind of uh, burgundy kind of uh, loofah, which kind of matches with the set. And then I got these candles at the uh, uh, Big Lots um, doing their 75% sale. And I just uh, adorned it with some um, shred, which I'm going to do it better when I um, wrap it up. But this is just an easy concept, you guys, that you all can use with these trays here. Okay? And that is the small tray. So let me go and show y'all what I've done with the medium size tray. I think I got, yeah, I've got. Here is another medium size tray, the same tray. I did take that skull off of there. So I've got a candle that I got from the Dollar General um, doing their, one of their sales. This sign I got from the Dollar Tree the other day. Um, I got the loofah from uh, Dollar Tree as well. This is Bath and Body Works. It's the white ginger body cream as well as the winter citrus wreath uh, hand soap. Um, I got some bath salts in here. And I've got these cups. I know, I know they're out there now at the Dollar uh, Tree. But I still had some. I think I've got three that was left over from Christmas with the green. And I, I think I used some for Valentine's Day, but I had a green one left, so I thought I'd just add this to this um, tray here. So this is just an easy concept that you can, um, if you all have these, the medium-sized trays, you can use with that. It's a little heavy. And I've got this other medium one over here. that I was working on, I hadn't finished it. So um, this is a bath set that um, I think we got last year at the um, Dollar General. Um, and then I've got the candles that we got from the clearance sale the other week. I got some socks, the black and white socks. 
um, the floor arrangements that I did last Sunday, you all remember. They've been sitting over there on my bar area for a whole week. They got to be wrapped up and put away somewhere, okay? So that's why, I'm, as you can see, some of these floor arrangements, they are already in a previous video. I showed y'all how to assemble them. Now, this um, is a picture frame set. Um, again, I have to, I, usually I take the picture frame out of this plastic and I put a ribbon around it. But these were $5 at the Family Dollar um, last year. But I got them for $1.25 when they went down to the clearance items. So by the time I add some shred in here, um, this is how this one is going to work, okay? So this is not complete. So y'all don't come at me and say, the sign, the, the price is on there. It's not complete, okay? I'm just still working on this one, okay? Um, let's see. And let's go with the large one. So this large one is the next one that I have here. Now what I did, I used one of my bears that I got from the uh, Valentine's Day clearance. And then I've got one of these pit, uh, floor arrangements that we got during the harvest. One A penny sale during, uh, I think it was in, oh God, it was, I wasn't in first part of December, maybe. Anyway, y'all know when that big harvest sale was. And that was a penny as well. This black and white cup I got from the Dollar Tree. Socks that I got from the Dollar General. Now this is a look, a black and canister that I just put the socks down in. This is a, a bath set that's the Spa Luxury Vanilla Sugar Body Lotion and the Body Wash that was at the Dollar Tree. And I've got these gold um, bubble bo uh, bath bombs as well. So this is just an idea, and I'm going to sh clean up my shred once I um, shrink wrap all of this one, okay? And this last one is this red and black theme here. Now on this one, um, I have one of these rose bears. I got some from Timu and I got some from Family Dollar. This is the one with Family Dollar because it has that silver um, ribbon on there. So basically I've got this uh, floor arrangement that I got from the uh, Dollar General doing a penny sale. Here is one of the red cups um, that I got doing um, Christmas. Um, I have the red and black socks and I got a white loofah and I've got this studio selected uh, lemon scented Epsom salt as well as the body wash now they come in these sets that we got from the Dollar General um, they were originally five dollars I got it for 50 cents and here is the body wash as well and that was five dollars I got this for 50 cents so I am using the ones with the um, kind of the burgundy labels um, in this set here so you guys is this something simple that you can put together if you have these trays um i've had them the trays for a while whenever i clean my garage i move them from one side to the other i'm like i you um, really need to get rid of those and do something with those so today is the day now let me show you how um i did these put these together which is very simple so i'm gonna take this get this tag off of here right quick Okay, so that is there. I've got to get some tissue paper that I'm going to line the bottom with. You don't have to worry about any um, contract paper or anything because it's very, it's not really deep, the, the trays are. Now, this is one of the mugs that I did when I did the, um, let me see. This is the cup that I did with the um, flowers in there. I did the other Sunday. So I'm just going to kind of make sure that stays in there real good. And we're just going to put the mug here. Now, they can take the flowers out if they want to and use it as a mug afterwards. It's up to them. Now, I'm going to use the green uh, lemon-scented uh, body soap, which we're going to put right here. I've got this sign that says Love Grows Here. I got that from the Dollar uh, General. Um, I think it was last week, maybe. I, it, it was on sale for 50 cents um, because of, it was Easter. Uh, the Easter sale. Let me get this off of here. 
they got these at the bottom of these boxes they got that their glue dots there so we're going to put the lemon scented right here and this is the loofah that i got from the dollar uh tree and i'm going to just kind of put that there to give that a pop of color as well very simple you just placing the items in there you guys um now as for the shred i am going to use some of the brown shred um because i don't want to put green in there because it's going to be too flashy to me so you just get your shred and you can just roll it up and you can stick it in places where there is you see your white um tissue paper you just can pack your um shred down there. Now you can use any color you want. Um, I just thought that green would be too much. Now where the places where you all can see is you can see the tissue paper, you just put some shred in there to cover all that up. And, lock, and there you go easy peasy you guys so if you all have any of these trays um this is an easy concept that you can put together um with a, just a few items you don't have to put a lot in there sometimes um sometimes people have a certain amount of items that they can put in there you don't want to put too many in there where it's um really bulky and too full where it's it's too crowded you know but sometimes um what's the old saying less is more this is the um this is it <laughs> so let me know what you all think about this um do y'all have any of these trays if you do have you um thought about doing anything with them or are they sitting um in your stockpile area like mine have been <laughs> for almost uh over six months now okay <laughs> so you guys let me know what you think and i will come back and show you how i wrap them and once i wrap them and put the bow on there then you guys will let me know how much i should charge for each one of these i just hadn't had a chance to wrap them because i didn't want the video to be long but i have so many of them i just didn't want to be wrapping them and we'd be here all night on just one video um my goal is for uh, two videos per day. I didn't do any yesterday because I was um, celebrating with my family, but I am trying to get four out today. So y'all bear with me and please like, share, comment. And let me know what you think. Do y'all have in these trays? What you think about the concept? Should I take away something? Should I add something? You guys let me know. Um, and to the next video, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe because you guys, I've got plenty of stuff that is coming down the pipeline for Mother's Day, not just Mother's Day, just for any occasion. If you have some of these items, um, don't forget about Administrative Assistance Day. That's sometime here in um, this month, right before um, next month, Mother's Day. So that's a way for you can make some money. But just put your stuff out there and see what, um, what, you know, what feedback that you can get from your uh, baskets. But thank you guys to the next video. You all please be blessed. Bye-bye.